Oh, let's talk about that Jags fever. I know a lot of you have tonight with less than three days to go until the Pro Football Hall of Fame game in Canton, Ohio. Some diehard Jags fans are headed up to see it in person. I wish they would have taken me along. On your side, Rich Donnelly is live at the airport tonight talking to some of those fans. Rich. Yeah, thanks a lot. We are here at the airport and it is a party. This is the first football party of the year and I am joined by elite super fan, the Jags elite super fan, Nikki McLaughlin. And Nikki, you got 30 of your closest friends right here. Describe what it's like to have all these people getting ready to head out to Canton, Ohio for the Hall of Fame. It, it, it's exciting. It's a really, really exciting. We're, we're here to have fun and support Tony Baselli in his Hall of Fame induction. It's, it's exciting. Well, part of this is actually getting to Ohio. So guys, let's all head to airport security together. And this has just got to be the thrill of a lifetime. It's the first Jags player to be enshrined in the Hall of Fame. Exactly. As such a fan of this team, what does it mean to go through a couple seasons that weren't so great, but to see someone that you've been rooting for all these years get the recognition that they deserve? It, it, it's, it's a surprise. It's just, it's just an honor. I mean, it's excitement. We've been waiting on this day. We start planning this trip as soon as he was announced. So it's been a long time coming. Well, I got to say, we're going to make sure that they can hear all of you Jags fans all the way up in Canton, Ohio. So on the count of three, I want to get the biggest Duval chant that this airport's ever heard. So one, two, three. Duval! The Hall of, Shrine, Hall of Fame enshrinement is on Saturday, and I can tell you, it was loud right here. They're going to hear them when Tony Baselli gets inducted. As for now, reporting live from the airport, Rich Donnelly, First Coast News, on your side.